Hi guys, Terry here. Um, today is May 17th, and today is very low calorie day 37. Um, yes, I stuck with it. I'm still going on very low calorie days, and I ask myself why. But um, I'm going to do a quick um, mop, my own protocol um, vlog, and then I'll give you a quick update. So basically for my own protocol, I do um, vitamins in the morning, which are my um, multivitam, um, MSM, amino acids, um, my birth control, and my Synthroid. Um, recently I've added an egg in in the morning. I don't have it all the time, but um, it helps. It does help me. Um, otherwise, I'm stuck with the goose eggs. Um, I've added in green beans this protocol and I have been mixing veggies. Um, doesn't seem to help uh, hurt me. Sometimes I have extra protein. Um, sometimes I have flax bread. I eat marigold noodles and um, of course Choco D, lemon truffles and I do have MCT oil for dressings and um, coconut oil um, and that's it I haven't really changed anything else um, so that's my mop um, so I think the last time that I talked to you guys um, I had just done a steak and mug cake day um, I had a minus a point eight release and then of course a goose egg um, and I kind of wanted to give up then. I was feeling, I was feeling beat down, run down, burn out. Um, let me see what happened after my goose egg. Um, my goose egg, then I then got a point two release and, um, a point six release. So I had a little bit of hope there. Um, like I wanted to stick with it. Um, and then I had a point two release a point to gain and another goose egg. So I have been at 142.8 for the past four days. Um, and this is like a um, like a pattern with me. Like I keep hitting these same numbers. Um, last week it was 144.4. I was all over the place. Um, then I got stuck on 143.6. Um, so like I said, um, these numbers have been riddled with, I don't know if it's set points or what it is. Um, as of today, day 37, I am at 14.2 total loss for the um, whole round number two. Um, I'm a little frustrated and I really kind of just want to go to P3. I have um, nine shots left, um, but I kind of don't want to waste them. And I am going to do a third round, um, and I will do my, um, I like to take the break, uh, the long break, so I'll be doing my eight weeks, um, maybe more, maybe less, I don't know, um, probably not less, I'll probably do the full eight weeks for P3, um, I really enjoyed P3, and, um, I had just gotten the hang of it at 21 days, so, um, yeah. But 14.2. Uh, um, now, here's a little plan I was thinking about. Um, last round, I had to cut it short. Um, I think my HCG was um, unpregnant. And after I tested it, found out it was not pregnant. Um, so I quickly went to P3. Um, and we ended up going to Disney for four days, three days, four days, something like that. Well, um, our pass is still good for one more day in Disney, so I think Saturday me and my husband are gonna go to Epcot and um, yeah, spend the day and have a nice uh, day together um, without the kid. So, um, I will be on P2 still. Um, like I said, I don't want to waste. I've only have nine days left. Um, and if I skip Sunday, that makes it ten very low-calorie days. Um, 
I'm really planning on doing a cheat for lunchtime on Saturday. Um, not an extreme cheat, like I, I, I don't want to carb out, um, but I'm thinking um, of eating off protocol just for one meal and then maybe a chicken salad for that night because we will be walking around for the day. Um, I need a little more calories than um, 500 allotted. So um, I really am planning to cheat. I've never cheated on, pro I, I mean, you know, I do, I do my own protocol, but I've never actually cheated. I haven't gone out and had a piece of pizza. I haven't had, uh, you know, um, a piece of cake. Um, so I haven't done anything, but I, I am really um, kind of looking forward to having to cheat on Saturday. Um, I had thought long and hard about going ahead and going to P3, and I just, I just don't want to. I want to go ahead and go the distance. So if I cheat and if I gain, um, I don't have much leeway. I mean, 14.2 pounds in 37 low, very low calorie days is not much. It is given, um, I really am, uh, I'm 11 pounds under my LDW. Um, with my load weight, it comes out to 14.2 pounds lost. Um, I couldn't do that anywhere on six or seven weeks. But um, I'm thinking of, of course, doing that cheat and then having the five extra days afterwards to either get the cheat weight off or um, whatever, 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 whatever happens, happens. Um, but I just wanted to put that out there and um, see what you guys think. Um, that's about it. That's where I am. Stallsville. I live here. That's me, Terry. It's my block. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay. Well, that's what's happening over here. Um, not much. Oh, and um, Bert and Ernie. Bert died. Yeah. Um, so it's just Ernie. Kind of sad about that. <sighs> All right, guys. Um, I love you, and I couldn't do this without you. Um, you guys. From the bottom of my heart, I love my HCG family. Um, so, happy releases to you. Um, happy maintenance. Kick the goose in the butt if you're having goose eggs. And get off my block if you're in Stallsville. Bye.